Hi, this is Chen Nguyen from Finale Inventory. In this video tutorial, I'm going to show you how to create or modify viewing presets for either your sales order screen or purchase order screen. So let's open Finale. Um, so the, the capabilities I'm talking about are, are either at the view purchase area link here or the view sale. So let's click on view purchase. And what presets are are basically different views information from these list screens here. So the presets can be found under this sprocket or gear and we have some shared presets um, here's some summary uh, if I want to focus on shipments it's a different view that focuses on, on the shipments tab or shipment information and there's two types of presets one is shared which basically means that everyone that has access to the account is uh, sees these presets and user defined presets are ones that you create that only you can see so in this tutorial let's show you how to, you can create a new one uh, so I'm going to click on summary here and basically use this as a starting point uh, for my new preset. The first thing I do is I click on this little layout icon here and on the right are all the fields that are currently displaying in the grid. So if I want to, if you wanted to start over, you can just hit remove all columns and basically start, start over for, um, and start from a clean slate. But I'm just going to add a piece of data here. Let's say I want to add column. If I click on the mouse here in the button, it shows you a list of all the fields that are available. I'm just going to select, you know, a narrow down. I want to see my supplier information here. So I click on supplier. Here's my supplier information. Let's say I want to move this to the left here and kind of move it between next to the order ID. I can. Uh, if you want to resize this, let's say I want to resize the, um, the order date to make it a little wider to give it more space. All I do is I hover my mouse over to the right where it becomes blue, and then I just kind of then move it that way. And I can do the same for order ID if I want. And I can do the same thing for supplier to make it just make it a little wider. If I'm happy with this layout here, um, all I do is now I'm ready to save it. So to save it, I click on the sprocket and I hit save current screen as preset. So the first choice you have to make is, do you want to save this as a user preset, meaning only you can see it, or do you want to show this as a, as a shared preset? Um, let's say I want to share it with all of my colleagues, and I'm going to type a, a new one in here called, which is a summary two, for lack of a better um, title. To save it, my last step is I hit the save um, button here, and now it's saved. So now if I go back to my my shared screen, now I see my summary too. So now I have a different view um, of information. So that's how you, that's how it, that's, you know, this tutorial shows you how to quickly create presets. Now, if you have any questions uh, as you create your own presets, feel free to email us at service at finaleinventory.com. Thank you.